You know, uh, it's one thing to say that you think uh, Georgia right now is a better spot for you to uh, develop your skills in college football to go to the NFL um, compared to Florida. But when you slam an actual NFL player who made it to the NFL and you're a uh, freshman who hasn't proven anything to the team that you're joining and you have the nerve to call them out you and you have the nerve to uh, disrespect them and disrespect their uh, their production in their career, you deserve to get called out. Um, Jordan Hall, a, a highly recruited defensive lineman out of Jacksonville, Florida, who signed with Georgia last December, uh, went on a podcast and talked about Florida uh, sending defensive linemen to the NFL. Uh, this is an article on SaturdayDownSouth.com by Keith Farner. And... He he said he says this. He says Florida talked a lot about nothing, and Georgia talked a lot about something. Georgia gonna put people in the league. Florida ain't put a defensive line player in the league since Tavon Bryant, and he's terrible. Okay, buddy, you clearly didn't do your research because Florida has put several defensive linemen in the NFL before and after uh, Tavon Bryant, Dante Fowler Jr., Sharif Floyd, uh, Dominic Easley. Uh, Jonathan Bullard, he was one of my favorites. Uh, then after Tavon Bryant uh, came Ja'Ka Polite, then came uh, Jonathan Greener, Jabari Zuniga, Zachary Carter in the, uh, a year ago, and this recent, most recently Javon Dexter. So to say that Florida doesn't put defensive linemen in the league in the NFL is false. Now, granted, they may not have the most success in um, in in, in in the NFL, but at the same time, you're trying to you're still trying to get to where they're at. They made it to the NFL. You haven't done shit for your Georgia Bulldogs. You haven't done anything yet. You have no room to call out any defensive lineman uh, that came from Florida that's in the NFL. Um, while you're a freshman who has yet to play a game for the Georgia Bulldogs, um, you do realize the Georgia Bulldogs have a lot of talent on that defensive lineman. And and uh, you may not necessarily get on the field. Uh, that that's what happened with Bear Alexander, a guy who would have been your teammate, but he transferred out to go join USC because he had a better chance of being a starter there. You on the other hand are trying to work your way up to be a starter, so you have no room to call out anybody as a freshman who has not played in uh, college football yet. Now, maybe it's one thing if you would have said, well, they haven't put a defensive lineman in the first round since Taven Bryant. But even that's the case, you still have no room to speak on them. You wouldn't talk crap about the seniors, the juniors and seniors on your Georgia Bulldogs team because you know they would address you immediately. So why on earth would you uh, talk about a guy in the NFL? If you wouldn't call out the, the juniors and seniors on Georgia's team, why would you call out a guy who actually made it to the NFL? And not only that, but you were so arrogant and so ignorant about your information, you didn't even do the research. Um, it, you clearly didn't read about all the defensive linemen that have gone into the NFL that came from Florida before and after Taven Bryant. So that just goes to show how ignorant your statement was. And... It's just, this was just stupid what you did. This was absolutely stupid what you did. It was not correct at all. It was. It's just not correct at all. You haven't done anything in uh, at Georgia yet. Why don't you prove yourself on the field? Then maybe you can develop the cachet to uh, talk about uh, to talk about any defense alignment that came from Florida. And what also was stupid about what you said was you talking about, oh, well, they haven't put a defense in line, but at least it's Taven Bryant. That wasn't Billy Napier's staff. How can you tribute Billy Napier's staff to Taven Bryant? When, when Taven Bryant got drafted by the Jaguars in the first round in 2018, Billy Napier was coaching Louisiana. He wasn't even at Florida yet. And he had just got hired at Louisiana. So how can you attribute Billy Napier and his staff to Taven Bryant? That makes zero sense whatsoever. That was the damn. That was a damn Mullen player that ta that ta that uh, left Florida to go join the NFL. Taylor Bryant was a damn Mullen guy. He wasn't a Billy Napier guy. So to even attribute Taylor Bryant to Billy Napier is just that was just dumb.
And uh, I'll have to say, your nickname, Big Baby, it's starting to look like it's starting to uh, describe you perfectly. Because you over here t uh, talking about guys from Florida that went to the NFL, and you haven't even proven shit on the college football field yet.